All right, guys, this is what we're going to build today, some stilts. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, let me show you what we're going to make them out of. First of all, the pole for the stilt is going to be made out of this right here. This is a handrail. What kind of wood is it? Well, this is made of pine, and you find these in a stairway, nice and round on the top and flat on the bottom. We like the flat surface because it gives us a place to mount the step to. And the round part is nice and easy on your hands. Now the first thing I did is I made some templates out of some paper. What I want you to do is lay it on this 1x8 piece of poplar right here and I want you to trace all the way around the perimeter. Make a nice line. Good. Do it across the top. I'll go right down that side there. Okay, now before we move it, I've got two little dots. Now that's where we're going to drill two holes to attach the steps to the poles. Let me show you what we have here. You've marked out four pieces, and those are for the sides of the steps. Each stilt will get two of them. Now we're ready to mark the top. And that's where you put your foot. Exactly. Here's a guide right here. Mark two of those. The next part is for a grown-up, and I'm going to use a circular saw to cut along your marks. Now the sides of our steps are actually two pieces of wood put together. Now what we want to do first is put some glue down so we can glue them together. Nice even amount all the way around. Put a nice little design in the middle there too if you like. Oh, that's pretty good. Smiley face. Alright, now we'll just squeeze that glue and then we're going to tack them together. And we're going to use these inch and a quarter finish nails. Now, what I want to do is I want to put two of them in each block. So I'm going to hold it like that with my finger. See that? I'm going to tap it with my hammer like that. Now that stands alone. Then I simply whack it real hard. All right? All right. You want to try it? Okay. Okay, and I'll hold the board. There you go. Bring it up a little higher and hit it harder. Yeah, see that? Wonderful. One more nail. Okay, now I'll hold it. You hit it, but not my hand, the nail. Try to come up straight and down, up straight and down. Okay, up straight and down, up straight and down, up straight and down, up straight and down. Go ahead. No, that's all right. That'll go in. There you go. That's right. Hit it harder. Pretend you're mad at it. There you go. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Now that our boards are glued and tacked together, I want to do one more thing. I want to screw them together. Why are we screwing them? Because I want to make it really strong. So the screws don't split the wood, I'm going to pre-drill a hole. Now we're ready for the screws. A little more, push down hard. Just like a pro. We're ready to attach the tops to the sides of the steps. What I want to do is apply some glue and some screws. I'm going to use some two inch deck screws. And so that the tops don't split, I pre drilled those also. So let's have a little bit of glue right on there. Okay, good. Okay, now we'll take a screw and we'll put it in our pre drilled hole. You ready, Preston? Yeah, right. Nice and easy now. Okay. Perfect. You know where you made the two marks on the sides? Yeah. That's where we're going to drill two holes, and that's where we're going to attach the steps to the poles. I drew a line down the center of the pole, and I mark every four inches where I will drill a hole, and that's where we will fasten the steps to the pole.
Hi, Preston. That's right. Sand all the edges. Bevel them right off. I don't want to get any splinters or anything. Okay, Sophia, what we're going to do is we're going to sand the pole. I want you to take a piece of sandpaper and wrap it up around your fingers like that. Like that? Yep. And just go back and forth so we don't get any splinters. Rotate the pole. Okay, that's good. Let me just sand off that top a little bit. To attach the step to the pole, we're going to use a carriage bolt. Uh huh. A fender washer, uh -huh. a lock washer, uh -huh. and a wing nut. To give you still some traction, we're going to use these rubber stoppers on the bottom of each pole. All right, let's make sure the rubber feet are on nice and tight. You ready for a little stroll? Yeah. It's going to take a little practice now. Let's get up there. All right, what do you think? Great, thanks! Oh. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.